Alright guys, today we're going to do a, um, a quick review on the Osmaki chain rings. I've been running these now for six months, um, about 2,000 miles. Now, obviously, if you know, it's not anywhere near like um, the key rings, which are a lot less than this. These are properly overlaced. And both big and small. I'm running a 52.38 on here, um, so when you're pushing down it's like a 56 and the um, the pull up stroke is more like a 40, 48, 46, something like that, so it, is, it still feels like a 52 when you're actually riding it, which is it's nice, same with the 38 on the inside. Um, I haven't noticed any power gains this, I did run this on the power meter for a while and didn't really notice any massive gains from um, switching over. The main gain I found was actually from um, my cadence. Like I usually run a very low cadence, I was running 60, 70 RPM. Since having this here on, I'm running more 80, 90, which is um, a big help to me. It's um, limits most of the knee issues I used to have, which is good. Um, but so I haven't seen physically any, any power, power gains from these. These were second hand, these rings, I bought them for £50 to try them out. Um, the retail at £200, so I, you can find these for second hand for about 50 60 quid. so there's no point buying new ones at the moment. Um, but if you're having problems with cadence, I can definitely recommend it. I, so I couldn't see any difference in power, so I can't recommend it for that side of things, but definitely for for um, cadence side of things. Come in everything from 50-34 all the way up to 56-44. So um, something for everyone there. Uh, hope you enjoyed and goodbye.